Hey guys, welcome back. So today I have a little bit of a haul. It's a mixture of stuff. And I'm going to start again with the boring stuff so you don't go nowhere. Um, I've been telling you guys in the last couple of hauls that I'm trying to get a little more comfortable on my days off and not be like, you know, I need more basics. So I went to Walmart because I've been loving their basics. So I picked up this plain v-neck shirt it's super soft it's eight percent spandex so it's got a nice um it's just very soft and it was on clearance for three bucks i did get it in a double x so i could wear it with my next piece that's falling i picked up this gray hoodie um, it looks like that. It's got like this white going down the sleeves and it's got the pockets in the front. So this again is like, it feels like that velvet and it's so soft. I love the fact that it's got the hoodie. I can pull it over on those days where I want to be still warm because it's super cold, but still like, you know, not too thick. This was on clearance for five bucks. So they had this color and they had like a beige, but I like this one and I like the way that the hood comes up a little more. So it looks like that. And I figured this with some leggings, my sneakers, I can put on my jacket and go. Or if I'm lounging around the house and my eyes are watering. I still want to have something on just in case I need to run out. I think this is perfect. So I got that and then I saw that they had some workout pants and realistically I'm not going to be working out but I thought these were also nice to have for those days where you want to look like, you know those days that you're, you want to be sporty but more of like I just left the gym kind of a sporty even if you didn't, that's the look. So I picked up these, and these are like in this, not minty green, it's like a, I don't know, like a blue green sea foam, I think, I don't know. Um, it has like that detail on the leg, and then if I put my hand through here, you can see it's got like a little bit of skin showing there. So this was on clearance for five bucks from... $14.96. It's from that brand Avia. And I showed you in my last haul that I picked up a couple of like thinner hoodies and stuff to wear with stuff like this. And I think I have this color. So I think I have this color. So I think it's going to be nice, sporty, some sneakers. I can run errands. If I'm just walking around, you know, in the city, you know, sometimes we like to go in and walk around Fordham. Um, I can be casual, but still like, you know put together looking and then I found this one which is like this army kind of print kind of I don't know what but I loved this one so I thought this with a black hoodie my black Tim's or if I want to wear my black sneakers you know whatever it is I'm gonna get so much use out of it and this print is really in right now I've been really into like that army color army style print um, I know it's not called army color. It's, um, so this one is more of like a, again, like this color, like a bluish, um, blue green kind of a color. So I thought this was nice to wear, you know, if I want to wear it with this, I think I can do that. My sneakers and I'm ready to go. And I wanted stuff like this more for days where I'm doing a lot of walking. I don't want to be in jeans. I don't want to be pulling up my jeans. I don't want to have to be uncomfortable. If we're running like to the movies or if we're doing something simple, I can do a lot with this. So <clears throat> that's the first thing. Then I picked up these boots and I picked this up around Christmas time. And I forgot to show you in one of the hauls that I did. But it's these boots and this is from the brand rogue so they look like this and it's just like this taupey color but if you look down here it's got like studding going around in gold which i think is super nice it's you know pretty flat 
so you can do a lot of walking you can do all of that it's got the zipper on the side it's got the gold buckle detail which I thought was beautiful I was gonna get the black but I already have two belt two black boots and I was like you know something like this with some jeans and a lighter sweater like a taupey color like the one I showed in the last haul or like a nice white or something I think it's gonna look really nice and I can transition it into spring so that's that and I got this one in a size 10 because I felt like it was a little narrow here and the 10 fit fine so this is supposed to be faux fur but it's like a suede kind of a feel um let's go to Target so I've been picking up a couple of things for my next giveaway and just you know see what's in store and whatever I went into Target the other day and I wanted to pick up this Sonia Kasha makeup blending sponge it's the marble one they had a three pack but I wanted to try this one I was kind of like I've seen so many people talking about it how big it gets it does your foundation super quick so I wanted to try this and I saw it it was the only one there it wasn't on clearance or anything how much was this seven dollars so I figured let me give it a try it's less than 20 what the beauty blender is and I like a lot of Sonia Kashuk products so I was like let me get it then I kept walking around and I noticed a lot of yellow stickers so I picked up this physician's formula concealer twins it's got the yellow on one end which is the color correcting under eye circles and then on the other one it's a light color which covers the yellow for like minor imperfections I thought this would be great for under the eyes and it was on clearance for $3.98 from $5.69 so I was like you know what you're getting two for the price of one let me give it a try and if I don't like it it was on clearance and then I picked up the NYX lingerie in cheeky it was on clearance for 348 it's just like your basic nudie pink which i think will look nice with like any nude color um so i don't know if i'm gonna keep this or put it into the giveaway and then i got this nyx soft matte lip cream in zurich which was also on clearance and this one is more of like a i want to say orangey peach kind of a color like a like an orangey um apricot kind of a color so this one was on clearance as well i have a lot of these colors so i don't know if i'm gonna keep it again or throw it into the giveaway because we getting close so i got that then we went into target and i've been looking for this for a while actually I went into Tart I went into TJ Maxx for one thing, which was if you saw my Snapchat, I said I went in for one thing, which was a picture frame. So I picked up this picture frame here, and it's like this. It's from the brand Kenzie. It's got like this gold glittery kind of detail, but it's like jelly looking. And this was only $4.99. So I needed another picture frame for some pictures that I had developed that I wanted to take to work. So I got that for work. And then I was looking around and I found this Buxom Plump on the Double Lip Plumping Duo. So it's got a lip liner and the lip gloss. So it's in the color... It says it's a $20 value and I got it for $5.99 and it says it's got a mini plumping lip cream and a mini cream full on nuance hot toddy and hush hush. So the liner is in hush hush and the lip the gloss is in the lip cream is in hot toddy and it's just like again another nude color it's from Buxom, I love the plumping ones that I have. I love my White Russian. I love all of the ones that I picked up. So, when I saw this one, I was like, I want to try this. But, my thought is, I want to start picking up things for my next giveaway. So, 
I don't know if I'm going to add this to the giveaway or not, but that's the first thing I picked up. And then I picked up two of these um, brow kind of things. So this is the brow drama. Um, it's like a jumbo pencil. But I think what I'm going to do with this, if I don't like how it looks on the brows, I'm just going to use it as eyeliner um, for like the bottom. I don't know if I'm going to do this in the waterline, but <clears throat> I think I think I can make it work. So it is in Auburn, and it's just like a brown um, eyebrow kind of filler. It looks a little light for that, but I think I want to use it more for like a liner underneath my um, lashes. And then I picked up this, which is the Intense Liquid Liner in Smoky Amber. But this, because it's so thin, I want to use it to like flick in the front and like shape it up not really as like liner and if I don't like how that looks then I will use it as like a regular eyeliner so this was $2.99 and this was $2.99 so I figured let me give it a try and if I don't like how things work for what they're intended for I use them for other things like I don't like to just throw them out and be like ah you know so let's see and I know the crinkling is making you crazy because it's making me crazy, but I picked up the Cover FX Custom Drops in the color, in the shade N40. So I've been looking for these for a while and I was like, you know what, let me pick it up. I want to try it out. But again, some of the stuff is for a giveaway, so I'm not going to open it. This is $6.99 that I found it. It's in that um, N40 shade. So I'm going to see. And it is taped up. So I'm guessing people started like opening them and swatching them. Um, so I'm hoping this one is fine. But I picked up one of these. Then I found this MAC lip glass in Brilliant. I mean in Brilliant. In Goldfinch. And it's like that. It's like a gold. This is like a nice gold topper. So I'm excited for this. This one I am going to keep because I want this one for sure. This one was $7.99. So when I saw it, I was like, oh my God. Because there was a lot of stuff that was open and tampered with. A lot of the workers starting to like tape products and stuff. So I'm hoping that that's going to keep people from actually opening up the packages. Um, I showed you guys in my last haul, I picked up this Guilty Angel from Buxom as well. This one I'm throwing in for the giveaway. The other one I'm going to keep for myself because I wanted to put it into the giveaway and then I ended up using it. So, it's a gel lipstick. The Big and Sexy Bold Gel Lipstick in the color Guilty Angel. So, that's going to go there. And then I found this on clearance for six bucks this was the Kat Von D locket brightening powder in golden so it's just like a small one and I want to get I wanted this for I want to get like my sister-in-law gave me like a little kabuki traveling kind of um not kabuki but like a little traveling makeup um thing and I have it in my car for like touch-ups and stuff um, but I want something that I can leave like at work where I don't have to like go to my car and get anything So I wanted them to be small like I wanted all of them to be small like I said with my last haul I have picked up these little brushes So I want something that I can put into a little makeup bag for touch-ups or like last-minute emergencies and keep it there So this is the perfect size and it was on clearance for six bucks. So I'm excited and then I found this. This I've been looking for for so long. I was telling my sister-in-law because I think she's also looking for it. And this is the, this one is from Ruchi Professionals, the eyelash set. It's a, uh, so this has a pair of tweezers, but the actual clamp is like this. So it's for when you're going to put your lashes on, you can clamp them together. I use, um... A bigger pair of tweezers and I clamped them like that when I put on falsies but this one because of the way it's shaped I don't know if you can see that um, 
it's like it's like this so it's gonna grab it and you can press around it I'm gonna show you guys probably in when I go to use it but I've been looking for this for so long and I couldn't find it anywhere and it was $5.99 so the fact that it bring the fact that it bring the tweezers I figured it was a great deal because that just makes it like $2.50 each which to me that's fine so yeah that's what that looks like and I'm excited for this because you know I don't always wear lashes so I don't have like that you know just place it press it and go like I have to really get it there and you know I use three and four different tweezers and try to grab it and try to set but I think that's gonna make it a whole lot easier all right the next thing is I picked up this eyeliner and it's like in this army green kind of a color and it was $2.99 so This one I'll swatch. It's like like a very nice like green taupe kind of a color. So I figured let me tr give that a try. I have I'm always wearing black and brown, black and brown. Once in a while I'll throw in a little blue or whatever, but I wanted something with a little bit of color. You know, sometimes when you do a natural look, you want to do like a bronzy color or like a nude color or like maybe something with <clears throat> something like that a little green so that's what I wanted then I picked up these lily lashes um, adhesive so it looks like this it's from lily lashes and it was $4.99 and I was gonna get two of them because there was two but I was like let me give this a try I've never tried it I've heard so many people talking about the lily lashes in general so I figured the Lily Lashes glue might be you know pretty good so I was so surprised to see this I started looking to see if I would find like the Lily Lashes around I didn't find any but I figured let me try this and then this was on clearance this was the Kat Von D Metal Crush I got it in the color Thunderstuck which is just like a white very sparkly eyeshadow and for two bucks wasn't touched wasn't open it does have like a green kind of undertone to it so I don't know how that's gonna work but I figured let me give it a try so I told you guys in the last haul that I had picked up I told you guys in the last haul that I picked up one of these Vitalist healthy glow highlighter illuminators this one I picked up in the color uh, I don't know what color I picked up but it's like this gold it is what I have on my eyes today and what I've been loving this for is I brush this on the whole lid first thing and I don't know if you can see but it leaves like a beautiful sparkle on the lid sometimes I'll wear it by itself nothing else when I'm doing like a no makeup kind of look and I just want a little something I've been loving this so much so now I do my makeup any makeup that I'm doing I use that as my base I do that all over the lid and then I start adding color so I went back and found this one in the color does this even have a color um, I don't know so I picked up another gold and then this one so this one is more of like a bronzier color this is more of a gold color because okay so this one is called sundown number five and this one is called daybreak number six so the gold daybreak the bronzier one is sundown love this this is so so nice I don't know what I was doing without it but it's like a moussey kind of consistency if you can see in there um, let's see I don't know if you're gonna be able to see but it's just like a beautiful moussey gold consistency and you put it all over the lid and then you can add 
a nice shimmer shadow to it you can add something else to it and it just gives you such a beautiful pop on the eyes i've been loving it i went back and those were the last two that i saw i picked them up i'm gonna try marshall's i think i've seen them at marshall's as well so i just want like backups because that's how much i love them oh i forgot to show you guys i found this at um walmart as well on clearance for one dollar i bought two this is the garnier skin active new moisturizing these are like sheet masks and it's for super the super hydrating mask provides deep moisture for instant softer more radiant looks I tried this and it left my skin feeling like you know once I took it off and rubbed in the excess there was nothing left but it felt like someone sprayed my face with water and I could still feel it like so hydrated the feeling didn't last that long because my skin is dry but I think these are great for like you know days where you just want to do a little pampering you just want to do a little moisturizing then you're gonna add whatever other moisturizer um, I think these are so good so I found I picked up two this is the only one I have left I'm saving this one for like maybe I don't know one of those days where I'm feeling tight something like that then I placed an order for the James Charles palette I told you guys in one of my other hauls that I went into the store and I really wasn't it really I'd seen it online and stuff and I was just like eh but when I went into Ulta and they had the display I was like wow this is a huge palette I'm gonna open it to show you I'm not gonna swatch it because I want to do a separate video on that but I am gonna show you so this is the palette and I'm sure you've seen it because they're everywhere now this is how it looks let me take this off I hate that the names are on here but anyways this is the palette and look at those colors so beautiful I'm excited for this color which is like a purpley something I'm excited for this gold I'm excited for this um, orangey color here this one over here oh my god I can't wait so I'm gonna do a look like a first impressions on this and my thoughts and all of that um, let me know if you want to see a certain color you know I know a lot of people have been trying to recreate this look but I think I want to do like either like maybe like a green color or a blue color I don't know but let me know but I'm excited it arrived the other day and I was like yeah so I love the fact that it's bubble wrapped and everything so nothing was broken nothing was cracked none of that I don't know if I had shown you guys this in my last haul I picked this up at Burlington it was on clearance for I think it was like five bucks but it's got the different size rollers I know you guys noticed I cut my hair it's super short now so I'm thinking of doing like rollers I need to get the little clamp but I think I'm gonna start doing some of that and I think it's going to be nice to have like a bunch of curls and like pin the sides up and just have it, you know. I want to see. It's Velcro so it might not need anything. I can just, you know, roll it up. I'm not a professional roller person so we're going to see how that goes. And because it's Velcro it might get stuck in my hair. It might be a disaster but I want to give it a try. So that is everything. If you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. We're almost at a thousand. I'm putting stuff aside. There's stuff that I'm not going to show that I'm going to throw in there. I want it to be like a huge surprise for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoy this haul. It's a little bit of everything, but um, 
I wanted to share because I feel like my clothing style is like shifting a little. I wanted a lot of dressy stuff for work and whatever. And then I go through a phase where I want like casual stuff because on my days off I have like nothing to wear. And I'm tired of wearing like the same stuff like my go-to. Like I want to go to something else. So this is the stuff I picked up. I hope you guys have a great weekend. Hopefully this will be up. Hopefully today is Friday. Hopefully I can have this up tomorrow. So hopefully when you're watching, it's Saturday. Have a fabulous weekend. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Hit the little bell so you're notified when my next video goes up. Which is going to be my look using the James Charles palette. Let me know if you want to see a certain look. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.